Hi, I'm Brian Bagri. I teach at IHPST, the University of Toronto. I've been teaching for 30 years. The fact is a lot of students don't buy the books they need, so they try to pick them up from the library. Um, they try to find what they can online. So giving them accessible course material that they will actually read because they've taken a step to purchase it or own it or get a hold of it is, is the biggest challenge, I think. And the major factor was the price factor. Um, the, the, you know, but the additional factor was ensuring that all students would have no obstacles to having a copy. Cost for students, is, especially students in science and engineering, um, is a major and I think unappreciated um, factor. My daughter's in first year here. Um, Three hundred dollars for text in one class is considered the norm, um, which is a great deal of money. Students in humanities tend to be better off, but even some humanities classes, students will pay between one hundred and two hundred dollars. They love it because they can open it and take it everywhere, right? So they don't have to carry around a big volume, right? Uh, they don't have to go to the bookstore and make the decision whether to buy it uh, or to get a used one or to rent it. Um, it's downloadable onto multiple devices. So if they don't, if they're not taking the laptop, they're going to the lake, um, they can take it on their phone or they can access Top Hat through somebody else's computer. So if they're traveling without any digital devices, they can go to London and they can go to the library and they can read Bakery's text. It's terrific. Top Hat Interactive Tax are liberating for a professor. So, you know, the idea is if I feel confident that the material is accessible and available and interesting and in a form that they are excited by, digital, right, filled with all sorts of interesting images that they can pull out and do what they want with. Um, I can feel comfortable moving away from the text. So, you know, the text can provide context for my lectures, but I won't be tied to that text in quite the same way. I think the top that text and traditional text are natural allies. I think that's the way that um, traditional print media should look at digital technology and vice versa.